So I am going to do a video today on glasses for grey hair or how to rock your silver crown. And the reason I'm doing it is because probably one of the most common questions that I get asked is now that I'm grey, what colour glasses should I wear? So now as we age, many things change, um, not least our appearance. And we begin to lose pigment from our skin, from our eyes even, but perhaps the most obvious place that we lose pigment up is from our hair. So very often this means that the colours you used to wear and look and feel great in, as you get a little bit older, start to have the opposite effect. However, if you choose to fully embrace your silver locks, there is a whole host of new stunning colours available to you. And the right coloured eyewear, um, chosen to balance and harmonise with your own natural colouring, is really your magical ingredient to looking healthy and feeling great, really, in your glasses. So today I'm going to tell you how you can rock your silver crown with fabulous, colourful eyewear. Firstly, let me tell you, number one, you are super lucky because so many colours look striking against grey hair. In particular, tones that are blue based or what we call cool colours. So colours like cool pink, raspberry reds um, and all the beautiful shades of turquoises and blues will really work to enhance your natural colouring and have a positive impact on how you look and feel and they are all fantastic in eyewear colours. Now, when it comes to grey hair, there are many different shades and intensities of grey and different eyewear colours will work better with different tones of grey hair. So I'm now going to touch on those different shades of grey to see if you can recognise yourself. So if you're someone who has very light grey or white hair, the lighter, cooler shades such as icy violet, icy green, baby pinks, baby blues, those light aquas um, and light silvers will really um, work fabulously for you and enhance your overall appearance. So if your hair is a more intense or darker steely grey, then you can be bolder with your colour choices and contrast light and dark cool colours. For example, a striking black and white. Or if you choose a single colour, make sure it has strength, such as hot pink, royal blue, um, teals and bold sort of blue based raspberry reds. If you prefer the lighter, softer cooler colours like baby blues and things like that, then contrast those with the darker tones um, such as black or grey for the most flattering effect. Now then, if your hair is just beginning to go grey, say you've got around 50% grey um, mixed in with your own natural hair colour, this creates what we call a salt and pepper look. So if this is you, the softer, cooler shades such as soft fuchsia, um, rose, charcoal as opposed to black, and matte silver frames will work well. In fact, on the subject of matte, um, matte metals and matte plastics or acetate frames really help to soften a colour and will provide the most flattering effect if you've got that kind of salt and pepper look going on. So, what do you want to avoid if you've got grey hair? Well, the most important frame colours really to try and steer clear of are those yellow based or what we call warm shades, such as golds, um, golden browns, yellows, oranges, sort of strawberry or tomato based reds and brown based tortoise shells because all of these colours can make your skin appear sallow or slightly yellowish and your hair look dull and yellowish. So that is my brief video on how to rock your silver crown. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you have, let me know in the comments. And if you want any more info or you want me to do any more videos on anything else, do let me know in the comments. Or if you or a friend would love a personalised styling consultation with me at any point, which does include um, a colour analysis, then just contact um, us at the practice on 01630 652 945.